the Spanish Trail Motel. I don't know if we're going to be able to get inside, but we're definitely going to take a look around. So right here is the old sign. Uh, they used to have the information of the bands that were playing, the artists that were performing, and uh, of course it would say Spanish Trail there. In the city of South Tucson, the, the owners don't want to, the owners of this building don't want to tear down this sign because it's too tall and they wouldn't be able to rebuild it because of zoning. So they think that it's a landmark. It's been here since forever. Like I said, uh, the original building was built in the, in the late 30s, maybe early 40s. Uh, and then this building that we're walking up to now, was added on in the late 50s, early 60s. There's not a lot of information that you can find online other than people remembering or recounting their experiences of working or, or staying at the, uh, at the motel. But uh, yeah, so here, right in here is the Gold Bar. And this is where a lot of the, you know, a lot of the movie stars that would stay in Tucson while they were filming at Old Tucson and Old Westerns. They would actually stay here at this, at this motel. It was, a, it was a very upscale, it was a very upscale place to be. It was like Hollywood in Arizona. But we're just going to take a look around and see what we can find. Oh, there's actually a hole in the gate. And we're looking around here, and uh, it's where the Olympic-sized swimming pool was. At one point, it had a high dive on it. You can see the swimming lanes. I believe right here is a wading pool. We have some of the rooms over there, a jacuzzi, and uh, some more houses and stuff over here, or rooms. So we're just going to go and kind of check it out, walk around. All right. Yeah, it's a lot of broken glass, huh? Uh -huh. So here, we're in one of the rooms. It's just kind of like a studio. Not much to see. More from the other side of the pool. All right, here's some more from the other side of the pool. We were just in those houses over there. This is the main... What are we looking at, buddy? Oh, it used to be a table. Here's uh, some other rooms, and these ones are way too beat up to go exploring. It's, I don't think it would be too safe to go in there. You can see the roof is kind of caving in in there. Uh, right above us, straight up, some drywall hanging, and just kind of just skeletons of what it used to be. What are we looking at, buddy? That thing on the wall. A flying spider. Oh, it's a, it looks like a bumblebee. This is the inside. Looks like a storage room, but it's on the back side of the gold bar that's facing the freeway. Lots of stuff in here. There's not really a path for us to walk. Hallway looking upstairs. And we're looking through broken glass. So that's as far as we go here. It's locked, huh, buddy? Mm -hmm. Alright, so. And if we can break this off. We can get inside. Yeah, but we don't want to break things, buddy. But look at, look at, look at the rest of it. Look at the rest of the grounds. So over there, these buildings here, those are the, those are the little housing that's associated with this now.
workers told us, there were some workers that we ran into, and they, they told us that we were uh, not able to stay, so you know, they're allowing us to take some last, last minute pictures of the front here, and then uh, told us to be on our way. So, what we're looking at here is the lounge area. This is where become. Hopefully, hopefully someone will restore it to what it once was, its former glory. Alright. Driving through the back area. Apparently there was like a, a, a golf course here at one moment in time. Uh, we're in the back of the property. We, uh, me and Matthew got kicked out by some workers. But uh, yeah, if you have any any information to share about the the Spanish Trail Motel, it's right next to the freeway. Uh, leave a comment in the in the section below, and please like, share, and uh, subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching. Bye.